by the Southeast Guilford High School JROTC and the playing of our national anthem. Thank you, you may be seated. Good afternoon and welcome to the Gateway Education Center 2021 graduation ceremony. Please join me in welcoming our stage guest, Chief Academic Officer, Dr. Whitney Oakley, Board of Education member, Ms. Betty Jenkins, and other Hilton Middle School staff. Please stand and be recognized. Welcome and thank you for your support of the students, staff, and families of Gateway Education Center. Parents, families, and friends of Gateway Education Center, welcome. I am Sarah Nakhtra, and I am the very proud principal here at Gateway. Before we start, I want to take a moment to pause and be grateful that we are able to be here together in person this very special day. This is our very first in-person event. And what an event to have um, for that to happen. So let's <laughs> It has been challenging, but the gateway spirit has truly come out during this past year and a half. We've had to be creative on how we did things and learn a lot of lessons along the way. But thanks to our amazing families and staff, our students continue to learn. We are here today to celebrate two amazing young men who have overcome many obstacles on their way to this very special day. Perhaps one of the biggest obstacles was over the past year and a half. Both of our graduates spent their last year learning remotely. With the help of their families and teachers, they thrived and showed great progress. We are truly proud of what each of them were able to accomplish. As we celebrate our graduates, 
interact with, overcoming the many obstacles they have faced. We will have some laughter, Someone in our town staff put together a special presentation for our graduates. This year, it was compiled by Ms. Catherine Wells, grad, um, teacher. Graduates, families, and guests enjoy the special goodbye to our two amazing graduates.
thank you, Catherine, for those special memories. This afternoon, Gateway School Counselor, Chantra Gray, will be sharing some words about our graduates. Chantra is a graduate of Appalachian State University and has been the Gateway School Counselor for 17 years. Around Gateway, Chantra is known as Fluff for her ability to shed a positive light on every situation. This afternoon, Chantra will be sharing words about our graduates, shared with her by some of the people that know them best. Ladies and gentlemen, Ms. Chantra Gray. Graduates, your teachers have given me the words that I'm about to share. So please know that it is them speaking through me. Would Catherine Wells, Beth Meadows, and Donna Phillips please stand? Today is a long awaited day filled with so many emotions. A sense of accomplishment and pride swell up within parents and staff. While we are excited for our graduates and what their future holds, we also feel an emptiness that you will not be with us in attendance the next school year. But before we talk about what your future holds, let's take a trip down memory lane. Jordan, you came to us in the infant toddler program. What a cute and curious baby you were. Your cuteness has developed into handsomeness and your curiosity developed into your love for science. And some of your discoveries you found that you like making slime, creating beautiful finger paintings, and caring for the memorial garden. One of your favorite science activities is cooking. We really wonder if that soon can be what you made. Either way, the items that you and your class have cooked and baked over the years have always smelled delicious. Enough about activities. Let's move on to the social aspect of school life. You are a star in all of our annual school musicals playing main parts. At prom, you were our best dancer. And when the school thrift store was open before COVID, you were a wonderful salesman because who could say no to you? As you begin your day program with exceptional family support, please take your Jordan laugh with you. By the way, we have missed your laugh at school so much while you've been on remote, learn, remote learning. Also, take your zeal for learning as you continue to work on your academic goals. Now on to Danilo. My goodness, what a guy. You are everyone's friend, and you will be missed beyond measure. We were so fortunate to also have you with us as a baby in the infant toddler program. Some things, such as your fabulous smile and bright eyes, have not changed. As you have grown older, you continue to use your smiling eyes for good as you welcome others into any room and make them feel comfortable. Danilo, you are an influencer. You influence those around you to do and be their very best. This seems like such an easy task for you, but others find it very difficult. With your calm demeanor, kind disposition, people are drawn to you. They enjoy interacting with you as much as you enjoy interacting with them. So it is no mystery that your favorite classroom activities involve good work or working one-on-one -on -one with staff instead of working independently. Your classmates depend on you because you lead by example. You try new things as well as persevere through the most difficult circumstances. You have modeled for us how to navigate loss. Your mother is here with us this afternoon in spirit. Throughout your grief, you make her friend. In all of my conversations with her over the years, you are her number one priority. There are no words to describe to you or to others how much she loved you or how proud she was of you. She knows that she can count on you to continue her legacy as you care for others through your community service projects as you attend Lindley College. As both of you follow your educational paths, always remember that you are important. 
ever part of the Gateway family. Come by to visit. Call if you feel there's anything we can support you in. Keep in touch because we want to hear from you. So as I close this speech, the most important part is here. The charge to you from Gateway. As in one of our favorite Times philosophers, Dr. Seuss. <laughs> Today you are you. That is truer than true. There is no one alive who is more than you. Jordan and Danilo, there has never, ever been a time in this world where they need you more. So please go and be you to our world. Thank you, Chantra, for being the voice of our graduates and teachers and sharing such wonderful words about our graduates. And I don't want it to go unnoticed that we have had these two young men since they were babies. So almost 22 years, they have been a part of the Gateway family. So that's pretty exciting. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, it's the moment you've been waiting for the awarding of the graduation certificates. If Dr. Oakley and Ms. James would join me, please. Danilo, Denard, Arena, Bowen. Please join me at the podium. Seniors, please stand. 